we are seeing is in four games is an all-pro performance by uh, Miles Garrett, who now three in a row he has uh, had strip sacks, which is unbelievable. It's hard to do once, let alone three games in a row. And they weren't just stat builders. They were real plays that meant real stuff. Yeah, you know how they have a three-pointer in basketball? I think they should have a uh, a two-pointer in, in uh, stats for, for sacks. If you, if you strip sack a quarterback, that should count for at least two sacks. Better yet, the referee should say, all right, that was a first down play. It's now third down. Yeah, listen, he, you know, I know a lot of people looked at that money that, that he was getting and they thought, wow, that's crazy. And we all know that within a year, that won't be, uh, uh, well, within a couple of weeks, I don't think that was the highest uh, um, uh, salary for a, a, a pass rushing defensive end. It's such an important part of the NFL in 2020. And he is such a special player that I had no issue with them wanting to uh, draft him where they drafted him and also pay him for mm-hmm. for what he can do on the field, even though we know he's coming off a season where he, he really hurt them with that suspension last is, year. Is it fair for guys like you and me, who uh, Rummies like us on a football field, to say that he does it effort? It looks like he does it effortlessly. Yeah, it certainly does. I mean, uh, it, but then anything athletic would look effortless to us. So maybe we're not <laughs> the best. Guy. All right, maybe not. Maybe not.